Me había estado algo. Good evening. Hello, hello. Hello. ¿Qué tal si yo, teacher? Muy bien, muy bien. Vaya, qué bueno. Ya le siento olor a los gatitos. Todavía poquito. Todavía no. hoy, hoy empecé a sentir un poquitito. Un poquitito, pero pasó bastante tiempo, ¿verdad? Pasa Good bastante evening. tiempo sin. Sí. Good evening. Good sin, evening. Sin el olor, sin percibir olor. Aprovecho, no, Lilian. Ya me van a decir a mí también porque en lo mismo estoy. <risa> Para aguantar, porque si no, más aguanto. A comer hasta después. Mm, yo como antes. Hoy me agarro la tarde, pero que les digo que la lluvia me trajo. Mm. ¿Cómo han estado? Very nice.
Hola, hola, me escuchan, díganme, estoy probando estos audífonos. Hola, hola. Hola, buenas noches, teacher. Good morning, everybody. Good, good night, everybody. No sé si me oyen. Sí, suave, pero, pero lo oímos. Sí, hombre, que todavía no he podido solucionar el problema en la cámara. Hola, hola. Good evening, teacher. Hola, ¿me escuchan? Yes. Hi, teacher. ¿Sí me escuchan? Sí. Pero bien despacio se oye, teacher. Despacio. Yo la escucho normal, teacher. Ah, ponerle más velocidad ahí, hombre, Mauricio. Yo tengo... Ver aquí. A ver... ¿Alguien más me escucha suave? Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Sí, se oye más suave. Es que cuando se conectó, sí estaba fuerte. Pero no sé qué le pasó ahora. Cuando me conecté, estaba sin audífonos. Estaba normal. Ajá. Es decir, con el micrófono de la compu. ¿Pero es demasiado suave o, o se, se comprende? Eh, se comprende. Ah, sí. Se comprende. Va llegando gladito. Okay, people, welcome back. Welcome to our second week. Let me turn on my light. Okay. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? How was your weekend, people? Mm. Okay, I'm going to take the first attendance and I want you to tell me something quickly, something 
short about your weekend. Okay? So what you did during the weekend. Okay? So, Ana Lilian Reyes. Present teacher. How was your weekend? Um, well, my weekend I was busing with no phone on Saturday. I I mowed the lands on Sunday. I spent the shop there with my car. Oh, okay, okay. Busy weekend, definitely. Brian Javier Escobar, Brian Javier Carmona Escobar. At one, Brian Javier at two, Brian Javier at three. Knockout. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Hello, Dinora. I only see your forehead. Ah, okay, now I see your face. Tell tell us about your weekend, Dinora. My weekend, I I was I was ill. I had a fever because on Friday I was vaccinated for COVID and. I oh, feel so yeah. really? bad for the weekend. I didn't feel anything with the two vaccines. Yeah, I was, uh, I had fever and my leg was so, I don't know. Your legs? <laughs> no, my, my arm. Your arm, oh, your arm. Oh, okay, okay. But, very good. Yeah. I believe that because of those vaccines, my, uh, because I, I, I think I had COVID. Yeah, but I believe um, that because of the vaccines, the symptoms were very uh, low. Ah, okay. In my I, case, I, I think I don't have, I never had COVID. So, no. me dio feo. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, very good. Good to see you here today. Frida, Janine, Mejia, how oh, she was attending today. Gabriela Irene Menjivar never showed up. Okay. Hey, Guillermo Antonio Garcia, are you here now? Not yet. Uh, Javier Aldair Escobar. Javier. Here, teacher. Hello, Javier. Tell us about your weekend. How was it? Um, I'm very, very relaxed. I'm sleeping. I'm eating. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Um, uh, I, I, como es que se dice? Pasear, como se dice pasear en inglés? Go out. I go. Uh, um, I go out uh, uh, con, con my dog. <laughs> and... Oh, oh, you, oh, you, you walk your dog. Uh, you walk, uh, you walk, uh, you walk your dog. And um, yes, so, solamente. But when you walk your dog, do you pick the poop? Yeah. The dog's poop? <laughs> ah, okay. You better do that. Um, okay. Because people yes, walk their dogs, but just to make them poop outside. But they don't and, pick... Uh, no, they no, don't no. Pick the poop. Okay. okay. 
José Arnoldo Mazariego. Hello, Arnoldo. Hello. Tell us about your weekend. How was it? Hello, Arnoldo. This weekend is this weekend is my turn for work. Ah. Oh. Uh, hello. Yes, yes. We can hear you. The image is frozen, but okay. Now, now it's a little bit better. You froze again. And yeah, it lost connection. Okay, Jose Galileo Barrera. Here I am, teacher. Ah, uh -huh. Galileo, how was your weekend? We miss you on class on Friday. What happened? Thank you. I my weekend it was really good, great. I went to my beautiful country or my beautiful city in Usulutan. Oh. Yeah, I went Friday that night. So I was eating seafood like shrimp, fish, curiles or conchas. Ah. And I, I was really good playing with my little boy, my wife, etc. Ah, nice. Very nice. But the Sultan is hot, right? Really hot. Really hot. Yeah. That is beautiful. Yeah. Okay. Right. Thank you very much, Leo. Jonathan, Jose Jonathan Vigil. Teacher. Hello. Hey, welcome back, Arnoldo. Sorry, estaba conectado por la computadora y no me se, no se escuchaba nada. Perdón, Jonathan. <laughs> okay, no problem. Okay, I'm here. So, Jonathan. Hello. Um, well, my weekend is was I was very occupied and relaxed. On Saturday, um, I make uh, clean the house, wash the um, uh, clean the house and take uh, take care of the the plants plants. Um, on Saturday, I on the, on Sunday I was relaxed. Okay, good. very good. What about Jose Rodrigo Hernandez? Thank you, sir. How was your weekend? Uh, relax. Enjoy football on the weekend. Ah, yeah. Yeah, Saturday, Sunday. Okay. Did you like the games? The matches? Yes. Okay. Very good. And Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Hi, good evening. Good evening, Catherine. Tell us about your weekend. What did you do? Well, I I slept all that Sunday. Wow. <laughs> and yeah, I I how do you say aproveche? Oh, uh, I take advantage. I take advantage of this day uh -huh. and I went to the church and I visit to my grandma because I I didn't see her for a long time. Ah, okay. Yeah. Where, where does she teacher. live? 
Erchi live in here in Santa Ana, but for the uh, COVID, I didn't see her because she is very um, sick. Yeah, and I, I, we need to take care of her a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, very good, very good. Thank you. Next right. is Laura Carolina Vigil. Hi. Hello, Laura. Hello. Tell us about your weekend. Mm, my weekend was relaxed. I did some shopping, then I saw a series on Netflix. I ah. also sleep a lot. I ordered for food at home. I am no cook. Ah, good. And what series are you looking? Gay drama. <laughs> uh, which one? What series? Um, what is the name? Uh, Bayon Evil. Bayo? Bayon Evil. It's a K drama. Oh. Okay, okay. Very good. Okay. I'm watching Grey's Anatomy. <laughs> it's a long series, very long. Okay, thank you, Laura. Okay. Maria Concepcion Ceron. Present. Hello, Mary. How are you? How was your weekend? Hello, it's fine. Uh, Saturday, uh, I work at, um, and Sunday, I went to room on behalf of the company for the benefit of children in New. Oh, oh, very good. Yes. That's very, very nice, very rewarding. Perfect. Maria Ivania Palma. Present teacher. Hello, Ivania, how are you? I can't, we can't hear you. Well, I cannot hear you. Are you speaking? Hello? No, I can't hear you. Try to see what happened and I will back to you, okay? okay. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Hello, Mauricio. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher, I'm, I'm here. Okay, how was your weekend? Uh, I had I had to work. Uh, I was paying in the parking lot Parking, parking lot marking. Hola. I listen. Yes, yes, I, I listen to you. With oh. the lead, we, with the lead, we were painting on Sunday. Painting. Ah. Painting, okay. painting on Sunday. The, the parking lot marking. Ah, okay, okay. Very, very hard, hard job. Perfect. Yeah. Now let's continue with Mayra Veralice Moreno. Hi. Hello, Mayra. Good to see you again. <laughs> what, how was your weekend? What did you do? I worked Saturday afternoon at my house. Oh, really? Doing what? Mm -hmm. What did you do? Es que estamos en IVA, entonces no llevo pudas o algo así. 
<laughs> ah, you do. You take. Uh, you took work from your company, from your job to your house. Mm -hmm. ah. O sea, de la mañana al trabajo y en la tarde seguía en mi casa. Ah, okay, okay. You can say that in English, Myra. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Very good. Now let's She's see. She's my co-worker. <laughs> She's my co-worker. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, Saira, what about you, Saira? Saira Marlene Larin. Hi, teacher. How was your weekend? Um. My weekend is uh, is very busy and tidy. And I have a lot of work. Uh -huh. Any and something special? At the hotel this weekend? No. No, everything. It's, it's, it's normal weekend full. Ah, okay. Okay, you had a busy weekend. Very good. Now, what about Wendy Maribel Zavaleta? <laughs> okay, teacher. I was work. Saturday in the Saturday in the morning, I wash uh, wash uh, clothes and sleep. Saturday in the afternoon, um, I go to the worship church of my church. Um, Sunday in the morning, and I visit no. I visit uncles and cousins in the afternoon, in Sunday in the afternoon. And I iron my uniforms Sunday at night. Oh, okay. Very busy, well organized, very well organized. Yes. Excellent. Thank you, Wendy. Now let's continue with Jacqueline Gloribel Rivas. Good evening. Hello, Jacqueline. How was your weekend? I work until I work until noon. Um I was to go to the movie um, Black Widow. Oh, is it good? Good. <laughs> okay, where did you go to see the movie? Multiplaza. At Multiplaza, ah, okay. Good. Excellent. Do you recommend the movie? Yes. Yes. Okay, very good. Thank you, Jacqueline. Only no more. Uh, Karen, Vanessa Morataya, let's continue with you. Hi, good evening. Tell yeah. us about your weekend. I was wealthy. All the weekend, I painted the most part of my house. And two days I was painting my house. You stayed home. Yes. A good girl. <laughs> uh, doing the chores. You know what is chores? Mm, sorry, I did not understand this. You know what is that? Chores. This word. Uh, 
The chores are all the things you do at home. Clean the house, wash the dishes, uh, do the laundry, and what else? Uh, mow the lawn. So all those activities you do at home are chores. No lo sabía. Es bueno saber. Sure. So, it's a good, it's a good way to spend your weekend. <laughs> okay. Let's continue with Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Hello, Mauricio. How was your weekend? What did you do? Your microphone is off. It's closed. Fine, fine, fine. Okay. Mucho, tra muy mucho trabajo. Okay. okay. Now let me hear that in English. Okay. <laughs> uh -huh. How was uh -huh. your weekend? What did you do? It money work or what do you say? Mucho trabajo. A lot of work. A lot of work. A lot of work. Oh, really? Yes. And when is your day off? Mm, Saturday and, and, and Monday. Mm, mm. Pero si hay carga laboral. Saturday and Monday or Sunday? Yeah. Sunday, Sunday, sorry. Oh. Okay. So you made overtime on Saturday. Mm. Uh, all day. All day. So that is overtime. So over overtime. Overtime. Okay. Good. Wow. That is money for you. Very good. Let's continue now with Rocio Lourdes Pimentel. Good evening. Hello, Rocio. How are you? Uh, fine, fine. Um, my weekend, uh, well, the last Thursday, I, I had to work all day. And, and and the Sunday, I have the, I share with my family and rest, in, rest a lot. A lot. Ah, okay. Only that. Mm -hmm. Very good, very good. Okay, that's it. Jocelyn Johanna Garcia never showed up. And we have here Brian Javier Carmona. Coming and going. Come on, Brian. Where are you going? How was your weekend? Oh, my weekend. Yeah. Uh, I work. I work in in Saturday. On Saturday morning, um, um, play soccer at night. On Sunday. I watch the TV and relax in my house. Okay, very good. Well, hola. Guillermo is here now? Hola, hola. No. Okay, perfect. Well, hola. I don't know if the, if, uh, Arnoldo and Wendy's group is ready for her for your presentation. Are you ready for your presentation? Yes. Yes. Okay. It's good to hear that. Uh, Está la otra compañera. Yes. No importa. Okay. 
the participants in your group. Okay. So, and if you can share your PowerPoint, and I don't know okay. what you're going to do. In this, in this moment? Yes, right now. Okay. I am okay. here. Catherine is here also. Oh, sorry. <laughs> only see. three? Only three? No. No. It's Naira. Ah, okay. Okay. Share your presentation, please. Okay, okay. Do you see? It's coming, it's coming. Okay. Now we can see. Okay. Do you listen? Yes, I can hear you. Okay. Handling instruction symbols. Symbols of packing providing safety, handling instructions. Will there is some overlap in terms of protecting the contents of the packing. Packing. The following packing symbols are also commonly used with trade safe handling, staking, and storage practice. As with the above symbol, various combinations can be used as appropriate adobe in mind to many icons can serve to confuse the user of the important information being overlooked. Okay. Then the first one is taking heading two bars with a number above provide information of how high the boxes can be separating staked. The number kit telephone vary depending on the nature of the packaging packaging of its contents. Are uh, the second net weight on height, a more detailed version of the boy packaging symbols at tower of boxes with a number in the middle can indicate staking height or something height. Waiting, the number in the middle box can indicate staking height or provide a weight. No, do not stack. A symbol of packaging boxes is straight next to the cross of sometimes with a cross over the main illustration. Tells the user not to stack the packaging. Contents weight. A weight symbol indicates the weight of the packaging, including content. This can allow users to decide how best to handle the packaging, as well decide which box, if there are different variants. They require the number waiting. The symbols can be changed as appropriate. personally, Rather than showing a weight symbol to people, lifting a box can indicate that it's too heavy for a single person to carry. Heavy, similar to about this packaging symbol, caution people to be careful when lifting the box, packaging due to its heavy content and or large size. Use pallet truck. The symbol of a sack, pallet truck with boxes stack, 
on indicated to user that this form of assistance should be used to move multiple items at a time. Do not use sack truck. Conversely, this symbol indicates that the sack truck should not be used to transport this packaging in this content as towing so may damage the items with them. And finally, do not use four leaf. Finally, an image for a four leaf alongside a cross or with a straight draw indicates the packaging. Contents are not suitable to be moved using a four leaf. Same for your rotation. Okay, very good, interesting. Uh, have you seen all those symbols before, people? What I have picture? seen, I have seen some of them, but not all. So it is interesting to know all these symbols related to packaging. Okay. So sometimes we damage things because we don't pay attention to those symbols. So we break stuff or we uh, damage the products because we don't pay attention to those international symbols. Because they, they, that they are international, okay? Okay, very good. Thank you very much uh, for sharing. And please share the presentation in WhatsApp. Send it to the group so everybody can have it, okay? Very good. Well, tonight we are going to start with a new unit. So let me go to share screen. And where is the book? Here is the book. Okay. Tonight's objective is to describe and follow the process to buy or sell others online. We are going to learn how to buy or the steps to buy or sell online. Have you ever bought something online? May you please uh, raise your, your virtual hand? Have you ever bought something online? Yes or no? Raise your hand if you have bought something online. I have bought stuff online. Only Arnoldo and I? Karen, who is in the dark now, Galileo, okay, oh yeah, mm -hmm. okay, Galileo, what have you bought online? I bought uh, some shoes. Shoes? Yeah. Really? The question, the question is, que he comprado? Yes, online. yes, yes, yes. Uh, okay. I bought uh, shoes, uh, I don't remember, but I uh, Little truck. A little truck. Chair. Can you, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you now. Okay, I bought uh, toys. Toys. For my, ah. my little boy. Like a truck, excavator, and 
I, I mean uh, toys, construction toys to my little baby. And are you satisfied with the products you bought online? The last buy, uh, don't, I, I don't receive oh. my pair of shoes. I don't receive it, the pair of shoes. So I also no recuerdo la palabra. Bag. Yo recibí un reembolso. Ah, refund. A refund. Refund. Wow. I received refund because okay. I don't receive okay. my shoes. <laughs> what about you, Katri? What have you bought online? Teacher, in, in my case, I bought a clothes. Ah, really? And some gear bombs. Ah, uh -huh. and I like to compare prices with the uh, online and the physical store. And it's what? better to, it's better to buy on, online. Oh, and what site do you usually use to buy um it depends that the thing that i want to i want to buy for can example you... if i want shoes uh, easy buy and i see that the page of these these stores or maybe in facebook market <laughs> ah yeah that's more common oh yeah or oh, amazon aliexpress okay Good. What about you, Karen? Tell us your experience um, shopping online. <laughs> I buy Facemat. Facemat? Uh, I don't remember. Uh, you, you sound far. <laughs> um, it took like uh, one month to arrive. One month. Yes. Or more. One more. One. One month or two. Okay. Yes, it's too late. <laughs> yeah, you have to be patient. Yes. Okay, but it was good. Yes, I liked it. You liked it? Okay. Yes. What about Arnoldo? What did you buy? The ultimate buy, I I buy tela. No se dice tela. Fabric. What? Fabric. Fabric for the, my the dress of my daughter for his quinceañeros um, party. Oh really? And I'm happy for 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 this buy. The product is the quality is is great. Wow. Also, that can be offered. Okay. So I national buy, from national. No, source, in no. Alibaba and ah. Wish. And Wish. I uh -huh. I discovered Wish about two years ago. Um, they have a, a good prices and the quality is is good. It's I'm, good. I'm happy with the result. But Wish takes a long time, or not? I remember well. The pay. I ordered uh, some things and it took months. Depends. Like four months. If you months. buy, if you buy on China, China is ah. is long time ago. But when the sale, the seller is on USA or Mexico, it's faster. The, the, it's, it's so faster. Alibaba is so faster. I don't. No tenía mucha confianza en ellos. But uh, 
and on this time, I prefer Alibaba that other book. Amazon is, is so bad for me. Okay. okay. Amazon only in Amazon Prime Video. <laughs> okay, yeah. So, and, and the, the others, why you have not purchased online? Is there any reason? I'd like to hear some of you. Why? In my, uh -huh. in my case, I buy online, but my friends. Your friends buy for you? Yeah, my friends, public, public in Facebook, Instagram, what else? Ah. Yes. And I, I buy with with them. Ah, with so them. you buy only from your friends. Only my friends, and ah. one uh, one time, one time soup, soup, uh, aloe vera soup, um, rice soup only. Ah, okay, okay. My friends and flowers. Uh, arreglo floral. Yeah, flowers. Flowers, eh, balloons, eh, okay. mascarilla. Masks. Mask. 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 Yes. <laughs> hey, Jonathan. And you, you are a technology man. So, tell. You, you tell me that you have never bought something online? Yes, uh, I bought a ah, cell phone. A cell phone? Yes, and on AliExpress, uh, I bought a handset, wallet in, in AliExpress. And another side, I bought um, groceries, uh, for example, um, um, superselectos.com, um, um, another site, I don't remember the name, but I bought um, beers, uh, uh, others, others, thing, for example, shampoos, uh, it's a distrib distributor. Okay. Um, I bought, um, basically only, 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 only thing. Okay. Um, oh, interesting. Uh, cell phone, uh, I, I bought, uh, uh, sometimes cell phone in AliExpress and it's, it's, it's good. good. See, it's good. And cheaper. Ah. Good and cheaper. Okay. Um, uh, uh, very easy. Very easy. Yes. Okay. Interesting. Well, if you see in your book, you have eight steps that, according to this, you must follow to buy something or to order something online. There are eight steps. They are not in order. Let me read them first. Okay. Let me read them come. And then we, you are going to put them in order. The different steps are credit cards information, confirm your information and submit, select the items, the item or items to purchase, go to the online web page, write your billing address, check the price, confirm the method of payment, and log into your account. 
blog your account. So please, in your notebook or in your book or wherever you want, put these different steps in the correct order. What is the first thing to do? Okay, what is the what second one? And okay. go on. <clears throat> do it individually, please. And then we are going to compare. When you finish, please uh, raise your your virtual hand. Okay, you see that you have already finished.
Teacher. Yes. Submit. Yes. Submit. Yes. Submit is. Enviar. Like send. Six. Raise your hand when you finish, please. Your virtual hand so we can see that you have finished. Seven.
open. otra mano, Rodrigo. Porque si no, esas del dedito pulgar se va, se, se quita. La mano como para pedir la palabra. Sí, la Two minutes, two minutes only. Yeah. Okay, in the in the meantime, I'm going to take the second attendance, okay? Mientras terminan. Or turn on your cameras. Don't turn your cameras off. And respond, okay? Anna Lillian Reyes. Present. Thank you. Brian Javier Carmona. Present. Okay. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Present, teacher. You. Uh, Guillermo Antonio Garcia, Chuar. Javier Aldair Escobar, present. Thank you. José Arnoldo Mazariego, present. Thank you. José Galileo Barrera, present. Thank you. José Jonathan Vigil, present. Thank you. Jose Rodrigo Hernández. Present. Thank you. Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present, teacher. Thank you. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present, teacher. Thank you. María Concepción Cerón. Present. Thank you. María Ivania Palma. Present. Thank you. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Present teacher. I'm here. Okay. Mayra Veranice Moreno. Present. Thank you. Zaira Marlene Hilarín. Present. Good. Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. Okay. Jacqueline Gloribel Rivas. Present. Okay. Karen Vanessa Morataya. Present. Good. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Present. And Rocío Lourdes Pimentel. Present. Perfect. Okay. <clears throat> Now, um, voy a ponerles acá una votación para que todos puedan responder acá lo que ya hicieron, ¿verdad? Ahí van a encontrar los diferentes steps, pasos que se van a poner. ¿Cuál creen ustedes que es el step number one? Lo marcan. Step number two, lo marcan y sacar el, el consolidado de todos para comparar, ¿ok? Ahí tienen ya la votación. Steps to follow when making an online purchase. Please vote. De acuerdo a lo que ya hicieron, ¿verdad? Así acá lo hacen más rápido.
Bien, ahí va avanzando la votación. Ya solo faltan tres, cuatro. Terminé la votación. Uno. segundos y cerramos la votación to close the book. Let's see. Okay, can you see the results? Okay, 89% Oh, agree. Oh. 
17 están de acuerdo en que el primer paso es go to the online web page. Ok, me parece correcto, ¿no? Es lo primero que hay que hacer. Vamos al online web page. Ok, step number two. Login to your account. Ya, yeah, ok. Perfecto. Eso sería lo siguiente, ¿no? Login to your account. Then, step number three. Select the items to purchase. Mm. Select item to purchase. Algunos piensan que check the price. Bueno, pero ¿de qué? Tienen que seleccionar lo que quieren comprar. Ok. Bien, step number three. Step number four, this is check the price. Okay, yeah, that's correct. You first select the item and then you check the price. Step number five, confirm the method of payment. Hmm. Let me see. Uh, uh, aquí veo una discrepancia, no pienso yo. A ver, dígame, ¿por qué? Está un poco dividido aquí. Siete creen que esto es. Hay cuatro que creen que es la dirección. Hay cuatro que la credit cards information. I like to hear your opinions. ¿Por qué creen que este es el paso cinco y no credit cards information? Firma el método de pago hasta el final. A ver los más experimentados en, en esto. Confirma. Confirma el método. Es fácil. After, after you check the price, you need to select the item to purchase. You, you don't, you can't, you can't pay anything if you know, don't know what do you want to buy. Yes, but the, the point is in here, number five. Teacher. Yeah, uh -huh. select the teacher. Post. Yo creo que es confirmar el método de pago porque le pide si es tarjeta de crédito o de débito. Ah. Okay. Yes. O Bitcoin ahora. O Bitcoin. O PayPal. O PayPal. Vamos a meter de la tarjeta. Antes de dar la tarjeta, información de la tarjeta. Bye. Ok, pues. Pienso, no sé, ¿verdad? Va a creer. Ya vamos a ver. Step number six. Credit cards information. Ok, hasta aquí. Damos ya la información de la credit card. O debit card, cualquiera que sea. Number seven, write your billing address. Sí, da ahí diez. Ahí está de acuerdo. Ok. Y punto número ocho, confirm your information. Ah, aquí se vuelve a confirmar. And submit. Ok. Bueno, entonces podemos confirmar el orden. Let's practice. Please repeat after me. Step number one, go to my web page. Repeat please. Hello. Go to the online web page. Okay. Tú lo dijiste, el matrimonio es 
Ok, number two. Todos están viendo la, la pantalla de los resultados, ¿verdad? No. Oh. No. No, el resultado no. No lo están viendo. Así es. Manual. Hola. El manual está en pantalla. El manual. Ajá, el de Freddy Carlos. Los resultados de la votación lo ve el que quiere, porque ahí arriba hay una pestaña que dice resultados de votación. Ah, ahí los pueden ver. Pues según yes. esto, yo yes. estoy compartiendo y ustedes están viendo los resultados de la votación. Yeah. That's right. No, no mano. Parece que. You're, you're right, teacher. I am seeing uh, the result. The results. Yeah, this house okay. is very for all results. Ah, okay. See, see here. Okay, good. Step number two, log in to your account. Repeat, log in to your account. Log in to your log account. Log in to your account. Step three, okay. select the item to purchase. Select the item to purchase. Select the item to purchase. Item to purchase. Step four, check the price. Check the price. Check the price. Five, confirm the method of payment. Confirm the method of payment. The method of payment. Step six, credit cards information. Credit card information. Step seven, write your billing address. Write your billing address. And step eight, confirm your information and submit. Confirm your information, information and submit. Okay, very good. Very good. So, according to this, those are the steps to purchase online. But I will give you more information about that. So, just give me a moment here. I will send to WhatsApp some extra information that if we have time, we're going to use it today, or if not, maybe tomorrow. Uh, okay. Oops, a long link. There it is. There is in WhatsApp uh, the information for more, more information about this topic. Okay, you can check it out later. Uh, now, We come back to the book, so let's complete these sentences correctly. Circle the correct answer. Number one, it's necessary to follow those steps or that steps to purchase what someone needs. What do you think? What is the correct answer, the correct form? Two steps. Those. Those steps. Okay. Number two, I think that I want to buy those big desk or that big desk. That big desk. That, that big desk. Okay. Do you want to buy this refrigerator or this refrigerator? This. This refrigerator. These. No. This. This, this refrigerator. This. And before I'm going to buy these two tablets with these credit card. Okay, let's go for the first one first. I'm going to buy these two tablets or this two tablets. 
this is two tablets. With these two tablets. With this credit card or this credit card? This credit card. This credit card. This credit card. Okay, very good. Very good. So we'll have a quick review of this topic. So how to use these, that, remember? These, that, oh, these, and those. These and those. Okay. Let's see. I have something here to show you. These are called demonstrative pronouns, okay? Demonstrative pronouns. No, go back, go back. Okay, so remember please, what is the meaning of near? Cerca. Cerca. Far? Lejos. Singular, okay. Near, this. Singular. Far, that. Plural. Near, these. Plural, far, those. All right? So we say this apple, that apple. These apples, those apples. All right? Any question with this? No, all is clear. No question. Perfect. So we have an exercise here and we have the same information. Let's practice with these sentences, please. Uh, repeat after me. I want to buy this computer. I want to buy this computer. I want to buy this computer. This computer. We check this cell phone on the web page. We check we this check cell phone on the web page. Web page. She's going to order that kit for her friend. She's going to order that kit for her friend. The company her friend. wants to buy that lift. The company the wants company to buy wants that to lift. Buy that lift. In plural, you have to buy these shoes. You have to buy these shoes. You have to buy, these shoes. Have to buy these shoes. He can pay with these credit cards. He can, he can pay, pay with any of these, any of credit these, these credit cards. They purchased those cards. They, they purchased those cards. Those cards. My co-worker my co-worker sold those products. Let's complete these exercises together here. We have short conversations. Number one, do you want to buy who give this. me the, the correct word for this? Do you want to buy this ta table? Tablet? Yes, tablet. Mm. Do you want to buy this tablet? This tablet? So you think it's near? Yeah. Yes. You can touch it. You can touch. color. 
Okay. Yes, I want to buy the black one. Number two, I can see mm, jeans. This. This jeans. Okay. My friend and I are interested on um, this make on this makeup. You know yeah. the problem. The problem is that. If someone asks you, si alguien te pregunta, si alguien quiere te pregunta como para confirmar, the small box, te está diciendo la caja pequeña, no la estás tocando. No está en tu mano. That makeup. Yes. That, that makeup. Um, ok lo mismo pensaría yo con estos con este this pero bueno no es muy clara la oración that package did you bring teacher uh -huh. he said the concepts are uh, near and far yes. near it, uh, it is not necessary touching in this moment. Well, actually near, that near, así de cerca. Mm -hmm. ¿Verdad? Así de cerca, como para que tanto alcance tocarlo. Yeah. No. Eh, Pero, por ejemplo, si alguien te tiene que confirmar, usualmente, no, yo sé que eso es un poco, eh, 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 muy era comprensible, ¿no? Si algo está fuera de mi alcance por un vidrio, ya es un dat. Ya. Yeah. Ya, es un dat. Si yo te tengo que preguntar, ¿cuál? Este con una de las ventanas. Sí, pero si está en un estante dentro de la tienda, enfrente de nosotros, considero que es near. O sea, es this, aunque no lo estemos tocando, pienso yo, y es mi duda. Ya. Yeah. Yo lo tengo acá, yo quiero comprar, estoy viendo acá, yo quiero comprar. ¿Cómo dirías? Este no está a tu alcance, este o ese. In Spanish I would use S. Because I cannot touch it. It's not in my hand. So it's different if I have it in my hand and I say to you, I want to buy this cell phone. ¿No? Quiero comprar este. Yo lo tengo aquí en mi mano. ¿Ya? En cambio, si está ahí, en un lugar que yo no lo puedo tocar, so, sería ese. Ese. Y tal vez si está más lejos, diríamos aquel. ¿Verdad? En Spanish. Que es la traducción de that. Ese o aquel. Es un poco relativo, ¿no? A, a, a la cercanía. Pero sí, eh, para mí el parámetro es más está al alcance de, de mi mano. Ok, number four. Did you bring this or that package? That yes. package. Aquí sí no es muy clara la, la oración de hecho. Porque puede que esté cerca o puede que esté lejos. No sé muy bien. Hey, number five. You can't add um, four sweaters to the chart. Esto suena a una, a una 
orden en línea. ¿Cómo diría? This or those. Debió dolerle su vocación desde el que me dolió. Dos. 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 Sin explicar nada. Está claro que Jesús tiene... And number six. I have to go buy new books at the library. I'm going with you. Dos. Dos. Let's practice these conversations, okay? Quickly, please repeat after me. Do you want to buy this tablet? Do you want to buy, Do you buy, want to buy this tablet? Yes, I want to buy the black one. Yes, yes, I yes, want I want to buy, to buy the, black the black one. Can I see these jeans? Can I see these jeans? Can I see these jeans? Sure, what size? Sure, sure what, what size? size? My friend and I are interested on in that makeup. My friend, My friend and, and I, I are in, in, interested, interested on, that, on makeup. that makeup. The small box? The small the box. box? Did you bring that package? Do you, you bring, bring, you bring that, that package? package? Yes, I did. Yes, yes I, I did. did. You can add those four sweaters to the chart. You, you can add those, add those, those sweaters four sweaters to the chart. To the chart. Okay, but can I take two? Okay, okay but okay. can I take two? I have to go to buy those new books at the library. I have, I have to go to, to buy, buy those, buy those new, new books at the library. library. I'm going with you. I'm going, I'm with, going you. with you. Okay, very good. Let me sh give you more exercises to practice this. I want to share this this slide with you in WhatsApp. Okay. Okay. Choose the correct answer for each sentence. Then we are going to compare. Actually, I'll send you to work in groups with that exercise, okay? So you can discuss. Okay, go to your groups, please, and complete that exercise together.
María. Doce. Doce. Qué barbaridad. Dos. Qué difícil boca. Sí, fishing. Estos, aquí me quede. La ocho. Dos. Ey, dos, dos. Dos, que sería, ¿verdad? Dos, dos, siento yo. Estos barcos. Esos. Estos barcos, vea. Sí. Ay, me movió esto. En el seis, no sería letter C. ¿Cómo? ¿El en singular, el pintura? Sí, en el seis. Es C, es C. Ajá, seis C. Uh -huh. En el Gracias. siete es... You told it yesterday. Pero que dice... That B siete B no hay ocho, así que como no, ah, no, 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 nueve y no, 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 dice hola doctor Smith could you please look at Puede ver, por favor, cut my finger, la corta de mi dedo. Cut my finger. This. This. Ah, ah, ah. Ajá, ah. Ah. Me vea. We can ask him. Diez. Tal vez si ellos me, pregun me preguntan. Maybe no, si no, nosotros, que... tal vez. Eh, tal vez, ah, tal vez si nosotros nosotros podemos preguntar policeman aquel sería aquel, no that verdad that. no sería dos uh, dos no dos o oh, dos That sí sería, that, that, that policeman for direction. Sería entonces. That, es singular. Mm -hmm. Sí, policeman, that. Ok. No está this, uh -huh. porque this y those es <coughs> plural, ¿verdad? Plural. Y this y that es singular. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ok. 11. 11. Was difficulties. Was. That. C. 11. That was a difficult test. We have.
No sé puede si ver, puede ver esta. Uh -huh. This. 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 On my finger. O sea, this. Could you look up this cut on my, on finger. my finger? Exactly. Ah, chifas, no, hombre, yo estaba en la 13. Esta, esta. Uh -huh. Hello, Dr. Smith. Could you please look at this cut on my finger? On my finger, sí. Porque no es aquella, es esta, this. Esta. I showed you my finger. Mm -hmm. Number 10. Maybe, maybe, we, maybe we can, we can ask, ask that policeman for direction. That, creo que. That, that policeman. Aquel. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. Tal vez podríamos preguntar, eh, we can ask. Nosotros podríamos preguntar. Aquel. That policeman for direction. That policeman. Mm. Aquel policía. Como aquel policía. That, that sería. Maybe, Maybe. We can ask. Tal vez nosotros podríamos. That policeman. That policeman for direction. That. That. Eleven. This was a, a difficult test we had last week. This was. This was. This was Those. a difficult test. Mm, it's singular. It's difficult to test. ¿Cómo sería el contexto? ¿Cuál es el test? Sí. We have este last week. Será un examen yeah. muy costoso. Mm. Okay, welcome back. Let's check some of your sentences. Oh, and by the way, uh, tonight with Brian, okay? <clears throat> so you're invited for 10 minutes after the class. Okay, please, uh, let me start with Rocio, can you read number one, Rocio? Yes. Um, look at those beers up there in the in the tree. Perfect. Thank you. Number two, let's continue with Mauricio Orellana.
توی آر آر دس بک Okay. Good. Number four is Jacqueline. Those apples are red, but these apples over here are green. Okay, well, it's time to stop here. I need to take the last attendance and we'll continue tomorrow with this. Okay, I will also share another exercise in WhatsApp so you can do it to, uh, at home. Just to practice, have more practice. Okay, and Olivia and Reyes. Present. Okay, good night. Bye bye. Brian Javier Carmona. Brian Javier, respond please. Present. Okay, don't go. Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Okay, thanks for attending. Have a good night. Good night. Guillermo, Gabriela, Javier Aldair Escobar. Present teacher. Sweet dreams, Javier. Bye bye. Thank you, teacher. Arnoldo Masariego. Present teacher, have a good night. You See too. See you later. Bye bye. Jose Galileo Barrera. Present teacher. Okay. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. So, Jonathan Vigil. Present. Have a good night. Good night. Jose Rodrigo Hernandez. Present. Okay. Hi, see you tomorrow. tomorrow Catherine goodbye. Marcela Castaneda. Present teacher. Okay, thank you for coming. Good night. Good night. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. Oh, too far, but I heard you. Good night, Laura. See you tomorrow. Okay. Maria Concepcion Ceron. Present teacher. Thank you for attending. See you tomorrow. Goodbye. Maria Ivania Palma. Present. Oh, are you there? Present. Yes, okay. Bye bye. See bye. you tomorrow. tomorrow. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Present teacher. See okay, you bye bye. Good night. And fix your camera. Mayra Veralice Moreno. Present teacher. Okay, Myra, sweet dreams. See you tomorrow. Zaira Marleni Larin. Present. Thank you for attending and see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. Okay. Blessings. Good night. Blessings. Jacqueline Gloribel Rivas. Present. Okay, good night. Good night. Karen Vanessa Moratasha. Present. Okay, good night, <laughs> friend. Sweet good dreams. Night. Thank you. Mauricio Antonio Rejana. Present. Okay, Mauricio. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Rocio Lourdes Pimentel. Present. Okay, good night, Rocio. See you tomorrow. Good night. Okay, Brian. No puedo conectar, perdón. No, no problem. <laughs> what can I do for you, Brian? Is there something that you would like to reinforce? 
double check, hay, hay algo que te gustaría revisar, reforcemos. Um, pues ahorita, nada más que estoy um, practicando, profe. más que todo eso he estado practicando algunas cosas. ¿Qué cosas? En lo de los ejercicios que nos mandan. Ah, okay. De los que nos ha mandado a, al WhatsApp, las imágenes esas que nos ayuda de, de hacer ejercicios, de terminarlas. Uh -huh. Going to, can, to. Entonces, ¿Cómo vas ahí? Con eso me he ido ayudando, pero hasta el momento creo que digo yo que voy ahí mejorando poco a poco. Y el vocabulario y todo eso también. Uh -huh. Excelente, excelente. Pero por el momento todo bien. Todo bien. Uh -huh. Vaya, mira. Sí. Bueno. Entonces, si querés devolver una uh -huh. chequeadita a minutitos cinco o seis minutitos al ejercicio que le voy a mandar ahora para solo que veo que en el libro hay como como errores así bueno la vez pasada usted vio que habían unos errores ahí en el en el sí. manual perdón sí sí la verdad que sí Pero yo creo que por el momento todo bien. Ajá, ahí he estado practicando, tratando de, de cómo se llama, de, de hacer los ejercicios y todo eso. Bueno, vale, vamos a ver. Esto lo voy a poner ahí después. Desde lo que hemos visto hoy. Es de Spanish a English. Tenemos que, tenemos que traducir al inglés. Exacto. Uh -huh. Como diría, uh -huh. esta es nuestra nueva oficina. De hecho, es practicando esto de this, that, this and those. ¿Cómo diría? This is, this is our uh, new office. Perfecto, our new office. Mm -hmm. Excelente. New office. Next, aquel es el camión de la empresa. Those is, those, those, por ejemplo, ¿cómo se dice? ¿Es this o, o, o those? ¿Cómo es this, realmente? Eso me confunde. These, those. De plural, ¿verdad? These, those. Pero me confunde con el otro, con el this. Sí, sí, la verdad que es... Este, vamos a ver. Este, este a es un bis, un poco más alargado. ¿verdad? Ah, bis. Y este es como un, un uno más corto y this. más, eh, como oh. dijera, des. ¿Verdad? La diferencia this. sería des. This. 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 Y el otro es dos. Y aquí es that. Dos. Dos. That, ajá. Uh -huh. Dos. 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 Ah, ok. Me voy a poner a escuchar a ejemplos de estos con, con nativos. Puro. De Estados Unidos. Entonces, ¿cómo dirías aquel es el camión de la empresa? Uh, that is ah. aquel porque está hablando del camión, ves, un uh, camión. Exacto. That, that is, is the, is the, no sé cómo se dice camión. Camión. Truck. 
se dice el truck, ¿no? truck, truck driver. Uh -huh. Truck driver, se dice, ¿verdad? Ajá. El, el, el motorista. Ah, de la empresa. Como es una empresa, <risa> sería... Puedes decir company. Mm, the company. Sí, mm -hmm. quedaría bien usar un possessive. The company's truck. ¿Por qué le ponen una S, profe? Uh, este es un, un possessivo. Lo que se conoce como nombre posesivo significa de la compañía. Ah, mm. no ah, sabía pues, eso. Por eso, por ejemplo, mm. algún negocio, ¿verdad? Que algún negocio que dice Joe's, eso significa de Joe. Pero ese es eh, el camión de la compañía. Pero ¿por qué está al revés? Yo veo que hay palabras que están al revés en inglés, o sea, que están una. Sí, sí, verdad, pues. Eh, este es el orden cuando es que le está dando como un como una es está funcionando casi que como un adjetivo dándole una eh, una calificación al camión y los adjetivos siempre van antes del, del nombre por ejemplo si yo quiero decir esta es mi camisa azul tengo que decir, this is my blue shirt. Oh. And not my shirt blue. Calificativo dice que eso. ¿Cómo es? Sí, exacto. Es cuando, cuando estás describiendo una cualidad de algo. Entonces, cuando ahí está diciendo el camión oh. de la compañía. Y aprendí dos cosas nuevas hoy. No sabía eso. The company's truck. Thank you. Okay. ¿Cómo sería la otra? Yeah. Esos son no, nuestros okay. mejores productos. Diría those. 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 Uh, are. Are. Uh -huh. Are our. Mm -hmm. The best. Best. Best or better? Best. 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 Best product. Better es cuando tú estás comparando dos cosas. Uh, este son mejor, los mejores. Este es mejor que aquel, por ejemplo. This is better than that. Entonces usamos better para comparar. Those are the best product. Mm -hmm. Y uno más, que ya se nos fue el tiempo. Estas okay. computadoras están arruinadas. This. Hmm? Uh, computer. Arruinada, podemos decir, are broken. Broken. Rotas. Sí, están arruinadas. Cuando algo está arruinado, puede ser broken. This is computer or broken. Pero está bien así, entonces, this. Sí. This. this. Correcto. Ah, pues sí. Perfecto, Brian. Excelente. Bueno, sería todo por hoy. Have a good night and see you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Until okay. tomorrow. Bye-bye.